Good evening. Here I am playing Sticks, Master of Shadows. And no, that wasn't a uh, voice changer. <laughs> but um, uh, today I'm actually going to be showing you how to get the pretentious trophy, which is where you don't use any items in a level. Uh, I found that it is the easiest to get during the very beginning mission, which is uh, Reminiscence. Um, the, fir the very first mission, anyway. Or, at least I found a method to do so. Um, also, I'll be showing you how to beat that level in uh, less than 18 minutes. Uh, not get any, uh, any alerts. And technically, I do kill one person in this. I have already recorded it. I'm just kind of giving you the intro, because it cut off the first section of the level, unfortunately. Um, I, I realized only after I had done it. But, um, it, uh, essentially... I show you kind of how to do it as well, not killing anyone, so you can get all three of those insignias. Um, and also get the pretentious trophy, so it's kind of killing four birds with one stone, or I guess one video in this case. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, join that video right now. Always keep to the shadows. Walk where it doesn't make too much noise. Avoid running and farting. And uh, farting, oh my gosh. Yeah, I can understand putting in a couple of jokes every now and then, but come on, that's not really a joke. <sighs> Gotta be sneaky here. If I stay under there, I won't be seen. Yeah, now definitely no farting. Oh man, now I'm going to the farting jokes. Dang it! Okay, anyway. Sneak past these idiots. I wonder if I'm going to be able to do this one in 18 minutes or less. I mean, I just got done completing this in 18 minutes or less. And, uh... Let's see here. And, uh, I, I got it in 18 minutes or less. Didn't kill anybody. Ah, and I my thought I hadn't used any I items. I was afraid that I lost you. Someone there. Be. Let's see. Uh, I'm I'm sure I got maps something. of the area. Yeah, you heard I'll something. More than that. Can't can't get what far. I want. Going far. Yeah, but I could be behind a door that you can't get through. As a side note here, you can kill this guy and it doesn't count towards your kill count. Strike from behind. Especially I can't leave this stiff lying around. Sure can. Messy. Why can I hide it? See if I can do this again. I found a really easy way to do this, and de all depending. All right, let's I, keep going. Yeah, yeah, keep going. Okay, I might show it again, um, or I, I guess never mind. Not show. Ah, shut up. A little spit that could put that torch out from here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so what I'm gonna try and do is what I did last time. What I did last time, I jumped up here, jumped over here, came over this way, and I'll wait for this guy to go by. Oh shoot, no, I'm gonna have to wait for this guy to come back. Okay, um... Well, you know what? I don't know if this is gonna bite me in the butt or not, but... Hey, cool, it's not! Now, I do have the fall, um, like, uh... What am I thinking? Shit, ability. More guards. If I stay hidden behind this barrel, it should be fine. As I was saying before, I was really interrupted by sticks. Um, I have the ability that makes it so falling doesn't cause as much noise. There is a box that's right there that I landed on top of the first time I did that. Um, oh, and here, just so you know that I have it. Oh, wow, it's not letting me cover kill. That's weird. Oh, there, I think it just did a second ago. Okay, now let's see if I can do this again perfectly. Oh. Oh. Now what you need to do in this situation for speed is try and get over here as quickly as possible so these guys start moving and then immediately turn around and head the other way. Because this guy's an idiot. Oh, let's just go. Come on. 
go. That's the fastest way I've been able to find uh, to go through that area. Um, and then, of course, not using any uh, items either. Now, let's see if I can do the same thing that I did last time in this next area here. Because I think this area can be a little bit tricky, so... Um, hmm. Well, I'll try it. We'll, we'll see what we can do. Um, I've got a little a backwards way of doing things in this next area here. Really wish that they would work on the load or would have worked on the load times here, but I, I definitely appreciate that. Like when you leave bodies somewhere, they just stay there forever, <laughs> unless you throw them over the uh, the edge, like I will show in one of my videos. It'll probably be my tips and tricks video for this. But uh, oh, let's go here. Head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your head. Fucking head. I gotta get me some amber. Yeah. Really? That, that would straighten me out more closely. Down there, maybe. It would be fascinating. Uh, quite so like a it, quick really. peek through the keyhole, just to make sure the way is clear. Don't need to peek through the keyhole because I already know there's nothing on the other side of this door. Amber, I gotta get some now. My head is gonna explode. You up. Hello, Rakash. I need your run carcass. Ugh. Damn it, I hate to. <laughs> yeah, always get rid of your guy as quickly as possible. Steal a body. Okay, now I found a yourself. trick here. Jump up on top of this, up on top of this, and you're able to come up here. Now, the reason why I come up here is I mean, not only is there a coin up here, but also you can get this guy to start coming up this way. Now, I don't know if I'm going to hurt myself by going down that way. So I'll, I'll just do it this way, because this is the way I did it last time. Um, what you do is, you wait for this guy to walk past. And you drop down here. And you activate the switch. Oh, fuck, it's gigantic here. Activate this switch. And put out the light. You don't want to get spotted. Now I'm going to save here because it's very important that I do so. Um, I think I'll save over this. Yeah, why not? Now I've already gone through this without killing people, which just reminded me that I don't, I don't have to worry about not killing people. Um, but if I did this correctly, uh oh, jump down there. Well, you know what? I'm gonna go through here. Why not? This pro guy's probably gonna spot me back here. Wow, this is a little bit different than the first time I came through here. But whatever, we'll just we'll just work with it. Now, because I don't have to worry about not killing people, I won't. But there is a way for me to not kill anybody. But I'm gonna just try and do kind of a speed run here, just so you can see my techniques, I guess. Because um, there is there is definitely a way to do this uh, where you can go down there and you basically just go up the wall down there. You fall down there, wait for this guy to walk over that way and this guy to be walking around that way, and then you just jump up here and jump up there. It's pretty easy to do uh, with timing and everything. I think that's the reason why I saved back there. But I'm just going to do this because I want to try and see if I can get through this as quickly as possible. Uh, um, let's see here. Shit. I'm do. A sliding grill. Stuck. Ah, this is impossible. There's got to be a way. Hey, sticks over here. Yeah, I know where he What's is. What's that? Somebody there? But if you walk up here early. Oh, never mind. I hey, guess it doesn't. Sticks there we go. Okay, good. Over here. Yes, I know. I'm looking at you. Would you mind activating, please? I'm on a time. I'm on a time. Hello. It's Oscan. I'll Thank open you. the passage for you. Hurry up inside. Huh? Ozcan? Oh, my head. Yeah, I know that name. Ozcan. Yes, you can trust him. Anyway, you don't have a choice. Okay. About to well, get that. Well. Looks like Ozcan carries a flask in his belt. Yeah, but it doesn't I could matter. easily find these marks with my amber vision.
Beat it, old man. I should keep my eyes peeled. Beat, Beat it, old man. man. This must be pretty valuable. Oh, there we go. Nope, jump. Oh, crap. I hate when that happens. When I push, like, all the way to the side and it doesn't go that way because of the angle. It's just kind of dumb. But anyway, um, I think I'm going to break the video off here and then start it up immediately after this. So, uh, well, we'll drop down here and get the those two things. Turn this out. And, all right, now... Oh, shut up. Now, I'm going to show you a way to get through this section. This is probably the hardest section to get through, unlike barely any... Um, like, without using any items and all that stuff. Um, which, here, let me go ahead and do this really quickly. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to follow this dude. <laughs> I was about to say, I'm going to follow this guy. Because the other guy's asleep. And this also puts me right where I need to be in this section. Um... Now, if you are following along, and I, I just realized that I actually cut off a little bit at the beginning of this this level, but the parts that I cut off were like just the very, very, very beginning. Ah, here we are. Okay. The mark drawn with amber. Invisible to anyone who's never touched guy. the amber. All I have to do is follow okay. the trail. I'm going to do something a little bit iffy. I might get spotted here. Oh, good. Looks like I'm not going to. Whew, made it. <laughs> but yeah, as I was saying, I, was, I cut off a wall in the beginning. Uh, well, get this, wait for these guys to come out. At last, Ozcan spoke to me of these list of hiding places, here. which must be you wonder something. if there isn't some sort of crap Take in it? here. Get out Gross of here. Of stuff like No <sighs> desire to hang around. Okay, now here is another spot that's going to be really good for me to uh, to save. Okay, so there was the one spot where I needed to, uh, I'll just save over the same spot, I don't care. <laughs> and this is why I saved. Uh, I cut out the section where I made a mistake. Pretty much that's it, so let's uh, join back again. Come on. See, this is why I want the load times to work a lot better, but or be faster, because then, come on. And I, I hate that they call it the cross button. I've always said X. I mean, cross would be vertical line, a vertical and then a horizontal line, I'd think, but whatever. Okay, so again, gonna wait here. I've, I've noticed that the crossbow guys seem to have, uh, like, better vision, so that might be why he's kind of spotted me. This time, I'm gonna use the, uh, I'm gonna use the invisibility a little bit quicker, um, and uh, hopefully that'll fix things. Yeah, shut up. Someone there? No. And I'm gonna roll because I don't want anybody to spot me. So, haha, -ha, I made it past that spot. Now there's this little spot here. Oh, come on. Hmm. Oops. Hurts, but what's going on over there? Oh crap! They kind of spotted me, which is bad. Oh my gosh, am I gonna make it? Must have been mistaken. Yes, you must have been. Nobody. I'm gonna wait for these guys to take their posts. And then I might just be able to walk past. Come on, work, work. Yes, okay. So there's a different way that you can get past those. I can't believe that I actually worked there. And there's a, I know there's a coin back there, but I'm not gonna get it. I'm just gonna finish this off so you guys can see. That I got the trophy, I think. I mean, I didn't use any items, so. And there we go. Yeah, I made it in less than however many. I killed one guy. Oh no. <laughs> but, uh, made it in 12 minutes and 58 seconds. So it's not all that hard to get under 18 in this, especially if you follow kind of my path, I guess. But let's see if I get the uh, trophy now. Come on. I made it through without using any items. There we go. Okay. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I got the pretentious uh, trophy there. So if you follow my way of doing it, it's really easy to do. Just uses two, uh, two invisibilities. And in fact, because I've got the time here, I'm going to go ahead and show you this little section. Um, come on, load. 
It, we're just in our hideout. We don't need to worry about it. And I did replay the mission, as you can see, I'm pretty sure. But I just want to show you the skills that I have. Um, I don't even have any skills here. I've got one skill here, which is Silent Landing. That was that thing I mentioned earlier. Um, I've got this because I wanted to get that trophy. Um, I've got this, even though I didn't use my vision at all. Uh, nothing in here. Both of these, which I didn't use. And uh, I, don't, I haven't made it that far. I have no idea what that stuff is. But uh, yeah, so there you go. That's how you can make it through that, not only in a limited amount of time, uh, but I kind of also showed you how you could do it without needing to worry about uh, killing anyone. I kill one person, but you can bypass them by, I kind of showed you in that section there, I might actually put an annotation that says, drop down here in this location or something along those lines. But where I showed you where you're supposed to climb up, I'm like, oh, in order to get past this without killing a guy, um, Essentially, you, you just drop down, and I did I did that before I bought the, the the Silent Fall thing or whatever. So if you time it just right, you can actually drop down uh, where the arch is, uh, where you're supposed to climb up, and just wait for those guys to go by, and then climb up and all that. So that way you'll be able to get past those guys without killing anybody, and then just follow my method, and you should be able to make it through without killing anybody in that in less time. Uh, without using any items um, and that's it so you get all three of those things completed oh and no alerts i guess as well because i didn't alert anybody so you'll be able to get uh three of the insignias and then also the trophy if you're having trouble getting that trophy and my ps4 cut off the outro so hopefully that helped and just remember if it wasn't evening when you watch this it's always evening where i am